Hey, what's up guys, SK here, and um, as many times as I wanted to record this, I realized that the video just gets long, no matter how short I try to chop it up and like make it seem like it's not as long. I tried to skim through it and just read through certain things, and um, that didn't really work out, because each video came out to be like 15 minutes, 20 minutes, 30 minutes. The first video I did came out to be like almost an hour, and that was just me reading through everything, and I was just like, yeah, I've been sitting here for an hour reading no and no one's gonna want to sit here for an hour to listen so i'm not gonna do that to you guys um the second one i did came out to be like 35 minutes and that was when i skimmed through like certain parts i just didn't read certain things once again no um and then 15 minutes and then 11 minutes and now we're just gonna go ahead and tell you guys to go read the patch notes because jesus <laughs> these are a lot of patch notes um, a lot of the stuff is kind of just meh. I mean, they've improved lighting and stuff like that. Like, the important stuff is mostly at the top, depending on what you consider important. Um, they've added, like I said, the new blessing, which we already knew we were going to get. They've added the two dungeons, the abyssal and the regular dungeon. They've changed the level on the no um, try. I mean, arena challenge which technically removes the wall that's there from level 16 to 19 because the whole problem was that you had to get from level 16 to 19 to do the no stream to, to continue the story quest now that the quest is level 17 you can um do it once you're at level 17 from level 16 and pursue the quest forward as long as you have the correct gear score so that kind of just changes a lot of things. Well, that's one big major sh major change for the game. Added tooltip for bloodstones, yay for that. They've also added um, descriptions to where you can get nightwood fragments. I wish they would have done that a long time ago. That was a change that was needed, like day two maybe. Um, they've added new mounts and stuff. Uh, just other things that I think that they've done that that should probably be mentioned really quickly. I'm scrolling up this because, just because, uh, they did nerf some skills of some classes, and let's see if I can find that real quick. Berserkers weren't touched though, so, ha 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 ha. Berserkers are fine all along. Uh, for Crusaders, they reduced the cost and damage of frontline destruction, reduced the cost and damage of Carver Path. For Mages, they reduced the cost and damage of Meteor and Blizzard, and... Now you only gain one mana crystal for using me for Meteor and Blizzard. And then for Priest, they reduce the cost, cooldown, and damage of Blades of Dust Justice. Blades of Justice. And for Rangers, I'm not sure if this is a buff. Rangers Lightning Arrow now does more damage per target when they're when targeting fewer enemies. So I'm not sure if that's a buff. That sounds like a buff to me, but I'm not sure if Rangers actually like that skill. I've heard mixed things about their lightning arrow and stuff like that. So mixed opinions about that. I said mixed skills. That was weird. I'm stupid. Um but yeah it's it's just a bunch of um fixes and things. I guess things people have been reporting since like the beginning of the game. They just decided everything comes into this patch. You know, except for the enhancement fix that we all want. But um yeah we'll see what happens in the future of um the game aside from this like this is a really good set of patch notes they've done here. Once again, it's a really big set of patch notes, so you might want to go ahead and read this yourself, see if there's anything you want to pick out of this. They are going to reset the Crusades and Invasions right after the patch, so be ready for you know people being starting to run Crusades and Regionals as soon as it pops off. If you want to get in on those to try to get your Storm Chaser, um, your storm chaser blessing um i'll probably be hopping on that train if anyone you know wants to party me what's up but uh yeah that's pretty much it when it comes to the patch notes that i'm planning on reading uh there are a lot of changes like i said you might want to go through this and read it for yourself it's on the website for the game bustunleash.com i believe is the website let's find out yeah bustunleash.com so go ahead and check that out, and I will see you guys in the future. Peace.